Hello, I'm Maxine Cutsalcott with the BloomHighlandsRanch.com. And I'm Lisa Waddell, and today we're going to show you how to do some simple yet elegant centerpieces. Excellent. Um, Maxine is going to begin on one, and while she's working, I want to talk to you about this one first. We have it in a tall, square vase. Very, very simple, just some gems at the bottom and miniature calla lilies, only three. You don't, you don't have to use several, several blooms to make a centerpiece. Something like this is very simple, very quick, which you could do, and yet if you use your professional florist, they'll be able to get you the quality flowers that you need to build this piece. Second, we have in the center an arrangement with one cymbidium orchid in it. Again, very simple, quick, easy. A wrap of aspidistra leaf in it, some gems at the bottom, a little floral decorative wire just to hold the bloom in place and yet give a little color. And lastly, we're looking at the centerpiece that Maxine is making and it's in a square vase. Squares are very popular right now for centerpiece work and in it we have gems at the bottom, a little lily grass wound inside. It kind of conceals your stems a bit and she started with hydrangea. The hydrangea work like a grid. It's one large flower for you to start with. Instead of, again, instead of using several, several blooms, you can go with a minimum amount of, of blooms and still make a full looking centerpiece. She has three dahlias, a little bit of bupleurum for her filler, and, a, and just finishing it off with a little bit of seeded eucalyptus. And you, again, another simple yet elegant centerpiece. Today, we thank you for joining us while we're showing you these simple yet elegant centerpieces. I'm Lisa Waddell. And I'm Maxine Cutts-Alcott for BloomHighlandsRanch.com.